Hi and welcome to this overview of the Limpopo Party Game and Wilderness Reserve lodges and camps which we envisage for the reserve. Some of them already built, some still need to be developed. I'm sure when you had a look at the slideshow which gives an overview of the Limpopo Party generally um, at the menu above, you notice the incredible biodiversity of the reserve and that's something that strikes us every time we visit is the vast variety of different ecosystems and habitats on the reserve starting with the Limpopo River down in the south which forms the southern border of the reserve um, with its lovely islands some areas the river gets about a kilometer wide so you've got fantastic islands reeds lollipops huge scotias on the river banks some large leadwoods um, and it forms a little oasis almost like the Okavango Delta in this area which is more of a semi-desert area in Botswana and then as you go further up you get into the Mopani and Acacia Felt or around Lepadi Hill which is another very unique feature of Lepadi this huge hill with its beautiful 360 degree views um, about a hundred kilometer far you just see no civilization only really authentic African bush and wilderness and of course around the hill you find different kind of vegetation large century old baobab trees, um, rock figs, marula trees and then as you go to the north here you come into a almost unreal surreal uh, kirkia or wild syringa forest a lovely area of the reserve as well you also find some of these open savannas or open plains where the plains game uh, tend to go and sleep at night and then on these little river underground riverbeds you find lovely uh, leadwood forests. So the concept of, or the beauty of the biodiversity of Limpopo Party was um, to, to create a, a various camp settings so that you can experience this biodiversity and that every time you visit you have a different experience in a different setting and even in uh, a different season because the seasons at uh, in Botswana radically changes from really dry in winter to uh, beautiful uh, lush springs and greens during summer. Um, so the first camp that was completed was liver, River Camp here on the river. Uh, it is fully operational for a, almost a year now since early 2009. It comprises of seven private lodges each one with its own central facility, kitchen area, braai area and then it's got a cluster of two or three bedrooms uh, around it. Um, it's also got a central a facility where there's a swimming pool, a deck which looks out on the Lipopo uh, River, uh, a bar, you know, area where uh, shareholders can get together and bry together. Um, and then there is uh, Island Lodge, it would be the next one which is half completed, next camp on the river. And Island Lodge differs from River Camp in the sense that it's got a, a larger central facility area with 12 one bedroom chalets or units uh, along the river bank clustered uh, around the central area. So it's more ideal for larger groups of friends and family that wants to come together in a central area and they just go off into their rooms uh, to sleep. Um, and then Island or, or the other camps that are envisaged um, would be firstly two tented camps. Um, we spotted a lovely copy in the northwest here and the idea is to have five luxury two or three bedroom tents around this copy, totally remote, very private, each one with its own braai area um, and a fantastic uh, um, experience at night, especially when you hear the night sounds of the jackal and hyenas laughing while following the leopards hunting in these areas. Um, then we have the uh, Marula tented camp area which would consist out of two clusters or two camps, one each with a central facility and some tents clustered around it, um, similar to Island Lodge in, in, uh, in the sense that it's got a central area with one bedroom tents around it. And then um, also similar to Island Lodge we've got Rock Lodge uh, you're on the western slope of Lepadi Hill in the saddle so that it doesn't break the horizon and that it almost melts into the rocky environment. Again a central facility with uh, a few units, one bedroom units clustered around it. Uh, fantastic spot to enjoy uh, the beautiful views during the day and the f uh, starry uh, nights um, uh, when you're out at night on the decks. So the concept was to, or is to, um, have these various different camps where shareholders could come and visit and uh, 
spend time in different areas every time they visit, even uh, during different seasons. Um, there's a lot more detail available, especially on River Camp. River Camp, uh, which is operational now, if you click on the menu at the right, or look at the menu on the right, you'll see the uh, central facility. You can click there or any one of the units. There's pictures and videos and detailed descriptions of each camp over there. I will also share more information on the different uh, shareholder rights with regards to camps and how can you switch between camps and when can you visit or how can you visit um, various settings. Uh, when you click on the Joining and Popular Party menu, uh, there is a process uh, where you can subscribe for detailed information on becoming a shareholder with us in the Popular Party. Thank you very much.